everybody, it's Crystal. So how's everybody doing today? I hope everybody is doing well and staying safe. So today I am going to um, show you some mystery boxes. I'm um, coming to you from my other house. So um, now these are from Mary Maxim. I always say Maximum. Mary Maxim. I got three mystery boxes. Will they be the same? Experience says yes. But just maybe, maybe, maybe they'll all be that they'll be different. You never really know. Now, um, if you're new to my channel, thank you for joining me. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and um, don't forget to turn on the notifications so you don't miss out on any of my videos or my hundreds of tutorials. Remember, I do have everything that you could ever want to make in multiples of them. Um, so let's go ahead and begin. Hit that like button as well and leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think about this yarn. Let's look at it. So I have bought from Mary Max. I'm, I'm, Maxim many 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 times before um, many 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 and um, I bought their mystery boxes many many times sometimes they're a hit sometimes they're a miss I'll say about 85% of the time they're pretty good so I continue to buy them whenever I buy from them I'll throw in a mystery box but I haven't bought one in a while so I thought I would throw one actually about three thought I would throw them in and see if they're all gonna be the same or different all right let's go ahead and cut into it and see it's a big old box <laughs> So they didn't send uh, separate ones, they sent them all together. I bet there's three boxes inside. Maybe, I don't know. I don't have a tutorial for this hat either. It is store-bought uh, as well as my sweater. Okay, here we go. I'm excited. I get excited about these three boxes. <laughs> okay, so... Sometimes they come in boxes and sometimes they come in bags. This time they are in this bag here. Nice. So these are $29.99 on Mary Max Maxim's website. Let's open it up and see what we got. I'm excited. Okay. So we got a ball of... Before we do that, they always come with patterns. I can't read patterns, nor can I write them. A lot of people don't know that. Um, well, they assume that I can read and write patterns and knit. I can't do any of that stuff. But, um, so these are no, no use to me. But they will be useful to some people, I'm sure, if you bought this. They have crochet patterns and knit patterns, usually in their mystery boxes. Just different ones there. So, yeah. Nothing for me, but cool stuff. So, alright, let's begin here. We have Mary Maxim Baby Value 100% acrylic, 315 yards. It's a medium weight number four. So this is very uh, similar to Caron Simply Soft. That would be what I, if I like this, how to say it, that if Caron Simply Soft had a twin in Mary Maxim va uh, Value yarn, this would be it. So if you're familiar with Caron Simply Soft, this is just like a dead ringer to that. It's pretty nice pale pink. So I got one of those. Oh, and I got it in white as well. So, those are go good together. Pink and white. And then I got uh, this thing here. It's, yes, Fair Isle yarns. I've done a review on them one time. So, it's this canister here of yarn. Let's read it. It's called Fair Isle Liberty Craft Colors. Contains six 52-yard, one-ounce balls of yarn. Um, no, it'd be 52 meters, 68 yards. They got that mixed up. Um, 100% acrylic, medium weight number four, machine wash dryable interesting it's like a paint can like a real long paint can but it's plastic well i gotta look at it i gotta feel it come on now i've had fair oil yarns before but i've never bought these little paint can things not that i can remember i don't even know how to open it oh it just pops off you see that it's like it popped off let's feel one Oh, that feels good. Feels like a nice acrylic yarn. I like that. That's pretty. So you got uh, six of those. 
It's a nice four way too, a nice thick four way. See that? Nice. I like the colors, they're all nice and bright. Very pretty. I like it. Oh, it has the names of the colors as well, but I broke it now. Go back on. All right, so there's that. That was in it too. Cool. And then we got some Royal Fatic Zeman yarn. This reminds me of the Mary Maxim um, palette yarn, kind of. That's what it looks like a little bit, but not the look and feel of it does um it's 100 percent acrylic 241 meters so about 260 yards or so machine wash don't dry huh. and it's written in other languages some stuff but it just looks like itself that's kind of how it plays out there see it's very pretty it's not typically a yarn that i would uh be drawn to because of its busyness but it is very pretty. I like it. And there's, what did I, what did I say the yardage was on that? About a, 260 yards. I got four of those in there. So, that, you know, they give you plenty to do something with. It looks like it's a lightweight three to me. Three weight, maybe a four, then four. But those are pretty. And then I got, um, these are the from the same brand, Zeman Super Soft says 99 cents on it i don't know if that's i think it's from another country so um eighty percent acrylic twenty five percent polyamide machine wash don't dry 199 meters so about 210 yards it looks like it's three weight maybe between a three now nah, it's probably a three weight yarn so 210 yards i got one two i got quite a few of those so i got uh 12 total five of the peach and five of i'm sorry seven of the peach and five of the hot pink um those are cool i mean it feels good i like those so that was what was in my mystery bag for 30 dollars. am i happy with well one of my mystery bags am i happy with that yeah i am i think that it's nice, even though, you know, I can't keep all this yarn because a lot of it's too thin for me. I like thicker yarns. I can't use thinner yarns because my hands are, I have arthritis. Thicker yarns work better. Um, they're all very beautiful yarns. Let's see, I got 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 18 balls plus this can for $30. Um, it's, it is a lower grade yarn. It's not like hand dyed, hand dyed yarn or anything, but that's that's okay there's nothing wrong with um value yarns in a mystery bag yeah i like it plus you get the patterns if you can read them i'm gonna put them back in here because more than likely i will be give these away eventually in a giveaway and i'm just gonna keep them in the bag let's look at the other ones want to so i have two more to look at and it's possible it's possible they could be the same oh no they're not they're not they're similar, but they're not, they're not the same. Okay, that's exciting. That's exciting. They have some of the same yarns and some different. So this one I got a bag of Mary Maxim Starlet yarn worsted weight. So I like this yarn. I've had it before. It's a nice value yarn. It's a four weight acrylic yarn. There's nothing wrong with that in a light pink. And then I got a ball of Mary Maxim Amigurumi. Um, I'm assuming that's probably and a cotton acrylic blend yeah 51 acrylic 49 cotton um 142 yards it looks to be about a sport weight that's a little too thin for me um in the orange i don't really know don't make amigurumi too much but so there's that but then everything else in the bag appears to be close to being similar so i got another one of these four more of these as well and then i got these again but instead of seven of the peach and five of the pink, I got seven of the pink and five of the peach this time. Opposite of what I got last time, in case I didn't say that right. Last time I got seven of these, five of these. This time I got seven of these, five of these. So I have a lot of these. It's just, it's, 
it's a shame that they're too lightweight for me. And the patterns, I wonder if they're the same. Um, yes, they are the same patterns that were in the other one. Nothing that I could use, but I'll put them back because, like I said, someone else could probably use them. I like this mystery bag too. I think it's worth what they want. I mean, like I said, with Mary Maximum, Maxim, sometimes the mystery bags are good. Sometimes, ah, they're just okay. But this time, I think they're okay, you know? They're not bad. I'm happy with it. I like the paint candy yarn. It's pretty cool. I'm happy with them this time. But most, like I said, about 85% of the time they're good. So that's why I continue to buy them from them every once in a while. Because, you know, I always say with mystery bags and, and stuff like that, it's just like, um, you don't buy with the expectation of getting your money's worth. You buy for the thrill of the mystery. Yeah. Okay, I got one more to show you. And it looks similar, but different. <laughs> different colors. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. What's this? Christmas stuff. Okay. So, in this one, I got the Starlet again. I like the shard. I do like the shard. I've used it before. I think I have tutorials and stuff. But it's purple this time and not pink. And another one of the orange amigurumis. And then everything else seems to be the same. I got four of these again. And I got my paint can. I'm just calling it a paint can. And now this time, <laughs> they got to spice it up a little bit and make it a little different. I got <laughs> six of each one. Six of the pink and six of the peach. That's funny. So in all three mystery bags, I got um, eight balls of, is that right? Did I say I mean, Yeah, eight balls of each. Yep. Nice. I mean, you can really do some damage with that amount of yarn. But like I said, it's too lightweight for me. Okay, final thoughts. Yes, yes, these were these were worth the thirty dollars that they wanted for them. I think. I mean, in my opinion, value yarn, but you do have to pay shipping on top of that too. Um, I did get twenty percent off because you can always find the twenty percent off code at Mary Maximum. It's not hard if you just go to Google and type in Mary Maximum coupon code. You know, there's probably several for twenty percent off. So I did get twenty percent off of these, so they weren't even thirty dollars. Actually, it might have covered my shipping costs, to tell you the truth. Um, but Mary Maximum also has sales where sometimes they have free shipping and, and whatnot. And let's see. So yeah, I would consider these a good mystery bag for Mary Maximum. I would, you know, like I said, I bought mystery bags from them a whole bunch. Isn't that a beautiful Afghan? Beautiful, beautiful. Oh, it's knitted. Um, and most of the time I'm happy with them. I'm happy with these. I think they're awesome. I love them all. And eventually you'll probably see them in your waist because most of the yarn is not usable for me because it's too thin. Because I don't like to use anything below a four. I actually prefer a five or six weight. But I do use four weights as well. So I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I'm sorry they were all pretty much similar. I kind of expected that most of the time they are. But every once in a while there's that chance. It's maybe, you know, maybe it's different. Could be different. That might have happened to me once out of all the times I bought for Mary Maxim. But hey, it's still a fun time. It's still a good time. Thanks for joining me I hope, and watching me open these up. Um, I'll see you on my next video, okay? Whatever that might be. I always enjoy talking to you with you guys. You guys stay safe, okay? Bye.